Hi, I'm Zaria. I'm a therapist. I work with folk her trauma. And in season four uh, in Love is Blind, we had Jackie who has gone through struggles in her childhood. And she was so beautifully honest and authentic about how she was struggling with the experiment and how hard it was. She described how she overfunctioned and people pleased for others. She described how she struggles with emotions, how she struggled with communication. These are all really typical issues that people who've had uh, ch childhood adversity struggle with. And what is a relief to know is that all of these skills can be learned. While you didn't get them in childhood, they are just skills. They aren't some magic thing that because you didn't get them, you can't learn them. So if we look at her things of emotional regulation, emotional regulation, if we can't regulate, we either shut down or go into flight or go into freeze. And then we can't communicate because we're struggling. We either hyper aroused or hyper vigilant and, and we see the world through a lens that says, I'm not lovable, I'm not worthy, I'm not good enough. And then we act out of that place. The more that we grow in self-regulation, the more we are able to move forward and to be able to uh, learn how to communicate and how to get our needs met in a healthy way. I just adored Jackie. I thought she was so... Uh, vibrant and alive and I felt deeply for her. For those of you who have had a toxic childhood and you've had adversity, if you look in my bio, I have a training on healing from toxic childhood and you'll see that a lot of talk therapy doesn't always help with folk who've had childhood trauma. You actually need specialized uh, therapy that works because otherwise you always just think it's you who's broken because you've tried different therapies and has ha hasn't helped. So you can check out that training where I go through the steps of what you need to be able to heal. I'm sending you so much love and um, I'm so proud of you for putting yourself out there and allowing us to be able to communicate about things, to be able to make a difference to folk who are struggling. I'm sending you love.